Hello and welcome back viewers and subscribers of AVT News. Olisi, the son of Tobe is my name. Um, I just want to update you on the ongoing Zaka regarding the Citizens Coalition for Change. You all know it. It's, a, it's Zimbabwe's mainstream opposition party, which is being led by advocate Nelson Chamisa. So as you would know, uh, the Triple C is involved uh, in a lot of internal wrangles following the popping up of a man by the name Sengezo Chabang, uh, who began to recall members of the opposition party uh, last month, uh, claiming that they were they had ceased to be members of the party. So there's been some court cases uh, in which Triple C is fighting to free itself from the shackles of this man who has been accused by men within the party of being an imposter, of being a fraud, uh, of being used by ZANU PF to split the opposition party or rather to dissect it uh, and leave it uh, at nothing at all because he has recalled uh, more than 20 members of the opposition party from both the lower and upper houses uh, of the National Assembly. He has also call, recalled more than 69 uh, rather more than 79 uh, local government uh, office bearers of triple c and in each of them his claim is that they have ceased to be members of triple c so the party is arguing that this man cannot wake up and claim that he is the interim secretary general uh, of the party without uh being a member of the party because their argument is that he is neither a member of triple c nor the interim secretary general of the party and they're saying that there is no such position uh, in triple c the only uh, leader they have is advocate nelson chamisa who has the power to appoint and unappoint members of the party and so far the people that chamisa is appointed uh, are uh, advocate Fatsai Mahere who was the first uh, national spokesperson of the party at its, at its formation. Uh, she has now been uh, substituted uh, in that position by Promise Mkwanasi, uh, who is deputized by Gift Ostalo Siba, who is one of the MPs uh, of the party who have been recalled by Chabang, uh, having written to the Speaker of Parliament to claim that the Siba and others have ceased to be members of the party. And the Speaker of Parliament, Advocate Jacob Mutenda, has been. Uh, following those letters that have been written to him and effecting these recalls as well as writing to the Zimbabwe Electoral Commission to indicate that vacancies have arisen in those areas where the members of parliament and councillors would have been recalled by Tsabang, resulting uh, in the president, uh, Emerson Nangakwa, last month declaring the 7th of November as the date on which the nomination court should sit and the 9th of december that is next month as the day on which by elections will be held in those respective areas where chabang is recalled members so what happened is that the recalled members tried uh, to overturn those recalls at the high court uh, in harare uh, last month but they were unsuccessful so the by elections i mean the nomination court set uh, as uh, had been declared by the president uh, on the 7th of november and members of triple c have been recalled then successfully filed their nomination papers and that means that they're going to be running uh, on the 9th of december under the triple c name again and now Chabang has also uh, deployed his own favorites in those in some of those positions where he wants them to contest as parallel members of triple c which means that there will be a split uh, of triple c representation in some of these constituencies especially those that are in bulawayo with those fronted by Chabang and those that are fronted by nelson chamisa so now what has happened is that a case has been now uh, been reported uh, at the high court so the, the that is triple c has gone to the high court to uh try and stop chabang and interdict it has been made at the harare high court uh, to interdict chabang and stop him from 
continuing to claim that he is uh, the interim secretary general of the party and to also stop him from instituting uh, further recalls. So what is happening is that I will read the top part uh, of the triple C interdict. Uh, it is uh, in, to the High Court uh, of Zimbabwe in Harare in the matter between Citizens Coalition for Change, that is the plaintiff, and Sengezo Chabangu of Fever Village Hetman Shabangana, Chief Mchane in Bomi Inyati as the defendant. You will realize that while last time it was members of Triple C who went individually as a group to try and stop Chabangu or to try and overturn the recalls, this time it is the party itself, Citizens Coalition for Change. Uh, so it, it reads the defendant named above. Plaintiff's claim against defendant is for an order interdicting defendant from directly or indirectly representing or purporting to be representing the Citizens Coalition for Change political party in any forum. Interdicting defendant from directly or indirectly recalling members of the National Assembly and local government authorities elected to hold office on a Citizens Coalition for Change political party ticket. Course of suit, if you wish to propose any of the plain to oppose any of the plaintiff's claims, you must enter an appearance to defend by making an appropriate entry in the appearance book kept in the office of the registrar of the High Court of Zimbabwe of Harare uh, at Harare within 10 days. So the case is expected today. So triple, I see, triple C. Uh, posted on the micro blocking site twitter this uh, uh, the top part that i have just read to you and they tweeted today we are heading to the high court to seek an interdict against the imposter who's been misusing our constitution to un our institution rather to unlawfully recall our members from parliament senate and council he lacks the mandate to represent our party or recall our members. The position of interim secretary general he claims to hold doesn't exist within our institution. So that is the case. Uh, we will keep a keen eye and maintain a keen interest on this matter. And we will, as and when we get any more information, come back here to share it with you. But for now, this is what is happening. Triple C as a party is now interdicted Sengezo uh, Chabangu and the case is supposed to be heard today uh, in the High Court of Zimbabwe in Harare uh, and uh, we will update you as to what has happened so for now please continue to um, subscribe to this channel like this video and share it so this case was first met on the 20th of October and it was set uh, on the 26th of October, so it's going back again today. Thank you very much.